How's it guys? Yeah, here's a quick update. Um, I haven't done much work on the boat. Been doing some work on the motors. Um, but I've had some complications. I had a crack gearbox and a couple of different odds and ends. Battling, finding the right way to get rid of the corrosion and all of that stuff. But anyway, I'll do a video on that as soon as they're done. But uh, I've done some work on the boat at last. Um, <clears throat> I've done the, there's the forward part of the floor in, uh, bulkheads and ribs underneath are done. Um, and then he has the fish hatches. I'm still planning if I want to put them more to the front or a little to the back, not too sure yet. And then also he has some uh, nice 42 millimeter bungs I'm going to be putting in with some nice stainless steel tubes so one will go right there eventually i'll put it through the transom there and then i'll have a nice uh, thick piece of pvc running through there probably 50 mil so any fish and guts and stuff that's in your fish hatch because the fish uh, especially like the stockies and stuff they normally get sick and then it's all sorts of whatever they've eaten and they get stuck in your tubes so I've made them 42 mil so not much will get stuck in there so yeah this is what we've done like I say the forward section is done the box is done the inside of the box is done so the floor for the fuel tanks etc all that stuff is in and then the floor you can see that it's not wood, it's what they call Nareko. Ach, uh, Nareplast. Let me show you a piece here quickly. So that is 20 millimeter Nareplast. It's like a honeycomb that's sandwiched between two layers of 450 chop strand. But this stuff weighs like nothing. I think that forward section there weighs probably about between 8 and 10 kilos if it is that much but yeah so that's going to be nice and light and then also the box is a uh, micelle 20 millimeter pvc foam which also weighs nothing so i think we're saving we're going to be saving a lot of weight at the end of the day when it's done uh, the knees there are a little bit high. They will go. They'll be dropped a bit once everything is finalised. But um, putting the floor in the front, I move the box back a little bit more. So now I've got to adjust the knees at the back to suit. But anyway, that's just a quick update. I know I haven't uh, uploaded much. I haven't really been working too much on the boat. I've had some other things I needed to sort out in the meantime but yeah um 15th of uh, december I go and leave so i can get a lot done while i'm on holiday but yeah that's where we are let me just look inside yeah you can see the that's the compartment for the hatches and then that'll be the hatch for keeping all the dry stuff dry so I'm not going to have to put my fish in there anymore because I'm going to have some uh, good sized fish hatches in the floor. So yeah, that's where we are. And uh, thanks for watching. And uh, if you've got any suggestions or if there's, you see something that I'm doing wrong, please let me know in the comments below. I mean, I'm a, I'm a programmer. I'm not a boat builder. But... Um, Lucky I'm handy with my hands, so we're working through it and then as we come across hiccups, speak to some people and then that's how we're going along. Thanks for watching.